life is like a spiral staircase because it can bring up to the sky or it may bring us down to the ground in a spiral way. I feel that a staircase can elicit thoughts and emotions up and down. What I thought is we need self-evaluation at all times. Thinking of what-if scenario, if there is no self-evaluation, it looks like there is no steering wheel while we are driving. I have listened to the song titled Stairway to Heaven. It is really a good song and it has a lot of meanings. Life has many uncertainties so, I believe we always need self-evaluation. Then I wrote a poem. Title is Never Ending Self-Evaluation. In fact, it is not a complete package. It is just a part of my thought. Or maybe it is just a small outlet of my mind. What is the root map? Who gives you the guidance? Why is it so important? Where to console? How to harmonize body and soul? Walking in the rain, standing in the snow, listening to the wind blow, waiting from the water flow, whenever, wherever, and whatever have you ever thought without your personal ego? Having intuition and vision concurrently with brilliant and dim, concentrate and disperse within, zero tolerance and slim feelings, salient and prime redeem. All are coordinating and contrasting. Do you consider how it goes and grows in between? Comparison of experience and feelings. Cheating and dishonesty mingling. Speechless and silence streaming. Cracked and crushed with hammering. Tangled and perplexity in the same scene. What are the driving forces unseen? Many times, wondering and wandering, interpret and interest in solving, comprehend and impress to understand, contemplate and make sense in reasoning. Solve and settle like a mathematic equation. Should I come across with validation? Habitually abridge and summarizing. Epitomize and condense some happenings. Alongside with some hell time and pilgrim. Witnessing and confessing in the twine. Divergence or convergence to be chosen. Would all minimizing both refrain? Self evaluations are never ending. Yes, self evaluations are never ending. Written and read by Sandra Beauty Tingalate.